A lot of research, a lot of um, watching court footage and reading as much about them as possible and reading the scripts, obviously, and just trying to do the hard, the impossible work of internalizing the, their experience. Yeah. I didn't research at all. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> it's, no, it's all it's all that. There's just endless uh, videos and, and um, just writings on them. All, it's all over the web. It, it's There's a lot of strange stuff and a lot of yeah. negative stuff, too, but... Our scripts are, are, are a Bible for us, uh, and and certainly our, our um, production team and the, the research they've done, the people they've talked to, a lot of them have reached out to to, to people that were in that world yeah. and that are still alive, the aunts, uh, maybe uncles. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so I, I, I think we've had such a great group of people to fall back on, other than our own research. Yeah. And certainly, the, again, the story is is strong you know what they've written for us so we draw on that we, we, we rely on that what didn't I do um, I, I really uh, I did a lot of research I did a lot of research on, on on the case itself I mean I remember the case when I was young I saw the case but there was a lot of stuff that I had I didn't know especially about my character who this person was before he was murdered uh, he was a Cuban as, as, as I am Cuban American came here at 16 was a very successful businessman in the entertainment industry and I really didn't know much about him and I got to learn a lot about who he was um, until the point where he was murdered by his kids uh, this is a true story it really happened uh, it was one of the first really I think reality shows because it was shown on court TV the whole case so every morning you can wake up and watch the TV and watch the trial every single day and now it's a big thing to see trials on TV but at that time in the 1990s 93 I think it was it wasn't you know people didn't do that so it was very very impactful and I think it in bringing it to, to, to light now again is going to be very impactful for the people to see well luckily um, this girl named Anastasia who uh, did, who works for Dick Wolf did so much research so she had these great Diane Sawyer specials the one where my character came forward and gave the information about the tapes and then there was another special where she does an expose on Dr. Ozeal basically how he was super abusive to her and two other women and um, you know I have the love poetry they wrote to each other I have taped conversations they had with each other I have so much research it's great and I can also just go online and see her tweets. <laughs> There's plenty of footage on Leslie Abramson there's a lot of stuff uh, videos of the trial and her on a talk show and her speaking to reporters there's tons of stuff to look at and she wrote a book and I have what people have said about her plenty of information enough to to get an idea of who she who she is who she was at this time